Hello everyone, welcome back to the channel. My name is Martha, if you don't know who I am. Today's vlog is going to be about me just kind of shopping for some of these pieces that I need. Um, if you see my first video, just talking about what I'm going to be talking about on the channel, which I will be talking about beauty, lifestyle, fashion, and me, you know, collecting my pieces all over again to start my capsule wardrobe. Um, because if you didn't see my first video, I'll link it over here somewhere for you. But what I'm doing now is I don't really have any clothes in my closet that I really want to put on. These are actually some new jeans that I picked up from American Eagle. Um, but anyway, I'm decluttering everything that's pretty much so in my closet. I have jeans in there that's over 10 years old. I know I need to get rid of. So I am about to clear that out. I'm doing that before I head out the house. Um, and then, like I said, get my taxes done, going to Sephora to try to catch the sale before it ends. But I think it doesn't end until Monday the 15th. Then I'm gonna probably go to H&M and try to find a couple of shirts because I want a light blue, like pinstripe shirt that I really wanted for these jeans. But yeah, I'm gonna try to do that. And then I, oh, and I did order two pieces from Cos. I ordered a white uh, Razorback tank and a white t-shirt. So, but yeah, but these are just gonna be my main, some of the main pieces that I'm just gonna start collecting slowly, but surely, but, um, but I will be showing you guys what I'm actually picking up and all of that. So yeah, so I just wanted to stop quickly, start this closet before I head out and I will pick you guys up back shortly. Bye. see the jeans that I actually pulled out the closet there's several more in there that I um, need to get out but my light bulb has blown so I can't really see what I'm actually doing for real for real but let me just show you some of these jeans that I actually have and I've had for like years years all these jeans actually came from New York and company so <laughs> these low low rise skinny jeans Low rise skinny jeans. I've had these over 10 years. I think I end up cutting the bottom of them because they were kind of kind of too long or something. But yeah, that's one pair of these blue color. Here's another pair. Just, you know, just kind of curvy. Oh, these were some um, actually boyfriend jeans or whatever that again had them over 10 years. these as well boyfriend jeans and see some of these have gotten a little snug because I could still put them on but they just fit they just fit different from you know years ago because my body has changed um some you know so yeah that's three pair right there here's a black pair that I just I think I picked these up from H&M you know they have gotten a little snug so I gotta gonna get rid of them so you know um, that's those, these white gap jeans, um, here, these as well. So I'm getting rid of these as well. I've only had these, I think probably about three years, but I'm not really feeling them for real. So yeah, these express jeans, straight legs kind of fit you, you know, throughout your hips, which I don't care for that. My jeans of style now is so different from these. I mean, I'm all about comfort um, and just, you know, fitting my body type, my silhouette of my body. So I'm looking for jeans that is very comfortable, very lightweight and just kind of flow with my body. So, yeah. So here's a pair from Express as well. Crop boyfriend jeans. They hit you at your ankle. So yeah, getting rid of these as well. And then here is some Bermuda shorts. Is another pair I have in there. So it's these, this pair and another like light blue color that I am going to be getting rid of. I used to love me some 
Bermuda jean shorts. Just love them. But so, but I'm getting rid of these as well. So yeah, I just wanted to stop and just show you what I'm actually kind of getting rid of right now. So yeah. back at the house guys i did everything that i said i was going to do all except one thing and i didn't get a chance to go to h m i got my taxes done thank you jesus for that because this was very last minute um and i did end up making it to sephora but i didn't get a chance to go to h m but however, what I'm going to do is probably go online tonight just to kind of look and see what I see out there. Because, you know, I'm looking for that light blue pinstripe shirt. So, yeah, that's what I'm looking for. But let me just show you what I actually picked up from Sephora. I got five items. <clears throat> I got five items here, excuse me. And... I knew exactly what I was going to pick up because I had it on my phone. I had it in my car. I picked up this one by the young lady, Winnie Harlow. She's the lady that has, the young lady that has the skin condition, which I think is called Vigilagro. And I picked up the Clay Skin Sunscreen, which is a broadband Spectrum 45. So I'm hoping and praying that this works well for me. So yeah, I really needed a sunscreen. Next item that I picked up is the Fenty Beauty Demi Glow Highlighter in the shade color Trophies and Shuffle, number seven. So this is a highlighter. I really don't wear highlighters too, too tough, uh, but I'm going to try this one because it's so, so pretty. So I hope it works well for me. And then next, one I picked up was this Rare Beauty Medium, the color Medium Deep and a setting powder. So I'm gonna try this. I hear that it's very light, light, and it doesn't give like a whole lot of coverage, but it does what it's supposed to I'm do. I'm hoping that this works well for me, so yeah. And then the next item that I picked up was this another setting powder, which I'm going to use this like um, setting my concealer. And this is the Airbrush Flawless Finish Powder by Charlotte Tilbury. I never use any of her products. I keep hearing a lot of good things about it. I was wanted to try the setting spray, but I already have one. So I'm going to use that up and try hers. But yeah, this is in tan and I hope this works well also it's actually five items that i picked up this i may have to take back because this is by patrick star it is the it's a lip liner and it's in it's the color is coin collector and i bought this because i was actually trying to find the lipstick by mac the color kingster but from what i found out i went to two different macs um, and they said that that Kingster is no longer available, is discontinued. So they, the young lady was telling me that it was something that came out when Nicki Minaj did some kind of collab with them. So that's been a minute ago. So I wanted to use this and that lipstick together, but I already have Chestnut by MAC, so I don't think I want another brown lip liner, so I might have to take this one back. So yeah. These are the five items that I actually picked up. I'm just so disappointed that I didn't get a chance to go to H&M, but like I said, I'm gonna go online and see what I see out there. So yeah, guys, thank you so much for being here. Again, if you think you may like this type of content, please consider subscribing, and I will see you guys in the next video. You guys take care. Bye-bye.